everyone! Today's video is going to be a shopping haul and I literally cannot wait to film this video because I have been planning on filming the shopping haul for probably like three weeks now but I kept buying more things like I would buy something online and while I was waiting for it to ship I would go back online and buy more things and it just kept going like that so I actually still have more things coming in the mail for me but I was like you know what it's already been like a month so I'm just gonna film a shopping haul of what I have because this is just getting ridiculous. Okay so I have everything from like beauty, bathroom, makeup, hair stuff to like clothes and organization stuff so I'm gonna start with the stuff that is in my bathroom and then work my way into the other things so if you want to see this shopping haul then just keep on watching. To start this haul off, the first thing that I got is that this um, body wash, it is Disney Princess. I got this at Myers. It's actually a three-in-one. It's body wash, shampoo, and conditioner, but I only use it for body wash because I have other conditioner or other shampoo and conditioner. So that is what this looks like. And it is in berry bouquet. Um, the scent of this body wash is berry bouquet, which I think it smells more like apple cherry cinnamon stuff so i mean it still smells good really good and it makes me feel clean and i love disney princesses so of course i had to get this body wash the next thing i got is this elf makeup mist and spray it is a spray that sets your makeup in this spray i got at hardings you can basically get this at any like grocery store in the makeup aisle or wherever elf wherever elf wherever else elf makeup is um sold so uh, i've been using this for probably a couple weeks now and i think it works really good oh, i can really like see a difference from like when i don't use it and when i do use it i think it works pretty well for so how much was this it was like probably around three dollars so i would think this is a very smart uh purchase if you are looking for one of these that is um very inexpensive. So yeah, this is the e.l.f. Makeup Mist and Set. And it has aloe, green tea, cucumber, and vitamin A, C, and E. So I mean, it's pretty good for your skin. So I recommend this. The next thing I got is some makeup and I have three palettes from BH Cosmetics and that's what they look like. There's three of them. Um, they all come with 88 colors and I have a matte one a neutral one and also a shimmer one. It was very inexpensive. On BH Cosmetics website they were having a sale. Um, it was three these three palettes for $25. The normal price for three of these palettes would be $60 so it was a really good deal so I decided to get that. And also I will post pictures of these three palettes so you can see what all the colors look like. And today I am wearing the shimmer eyeshadows. Um, shimmer really isn't my favorite, but I mean, they were pretty good. I mean, they're doable for me. So these are really good eyeshadows. If you're looking for good eyeshadows that are very inexpensive, I would go with some from BH Cosmetics. They work really, really good. Now I'm going to be moving on to hair. I have a new curling wand that is by Revlon. I can't remember the exact size of the wand, but I mean, it's about that thick and I got this at Kmart um, it was I want to say it was like 18 or $20 um, I've been really wanting a new one of these because I have another one but it's like I don't even know it's like less than a half inch or something like that so and I actually used this on my hair today and you've probably have noticed it in some of my other videos I've had curled hair I've been using this one because I really wanted a curling iron or a curling wand to give me looser curls which the other one being smaller and gave me a lot tighter curls so I just wanted one like this so I could have my hair like this basically because I really like how this looks so yeah um just like every other curling wand it came with obviously the curling wand and um glove to wear so that's always good um I've used this a few times 
or probably more than a few times, probably like close to like 10 times. It works really, really good, and I really recommend this. It's by Revlon, if I haven't already said that. That's what it looks like. Hopefully you can see this. The next thing I'm going to move on to is organization stuff, and I have a scarf hanger that looks like that. I have all my scarves on it. Looks like that. And I also have a necklace hanger that looks like this. So first off, I will start with the scarf hangers and then move on to the necklace hanger. Now for the scarf hanger, it's just this metal silvery colored thing and it has it's a hanger up here so you can hang it like in your closet or whatever and then try to move this out of the way it has holes all through it um bigger ones and smaller ones as you move up probably yeah there's the biggest one down there i think i've counted 18 holes i think so you can hang all your scarves on and i did just have one, but then I ended up getting another one because I didn't like how all my scarves looked on one of them. So I actually have a second one. This one I put all my neutral type colors on. So I have my whites, my grays, and my blacks. And then this one I just have all my like miscellaneous colored ones. I cannot remember where I got this. Um, I think my mom found it online, so I mean, the thing I would do, I think how we found it was like, try to look up like those like TV infomercial type websites. I think that's where we found it, but I'm not sure. I would just research it on the internet and you'll eventually find it. They were like around $8 a piece, maybe 11, one of those prices. So around there, they're not too expensive and I think they work pretty good. I've recently been trying to organize my closet with like scarf hangers and my necklace hanger and um, a couple other things. I'm really trying to get my closet organized. I'm having a lot of trouble and I kept buying all this stuff to make it more organized but then I just came to the conclusion I just have too much clothes. So hopefully when I get everything organized maybe I'll do like a room tour, closet tour organization type stuff because I've never did, I've never done a room tour on my room at my mom's house so I feel like I'll just make like a big compilation, compilation I don't think compilation is a word, but whatever, you get the point. I think I'll just make a huge video just... So I think I'll just make a huge video with all those things if I ever do get everything all organized. So these are what this scarf's hanger look like. The next thing I'm going to move on to is this necklace hanger. I'm going to try to talk without the little jingle jangles of my necklaces. But I got this at Meijer. Um, I think it was around $10. They have this black one. That looks like this and I think they also had like a silver one and a white one um, just the neutral colors I know they have a couple of colors and on the whoa on the top there's little holes where you can like hang earrings like little danglies and then there's a little hoopy thingies like this where you can hang all of your necklaces which that is what I've done if you can see I have my longer ones and then it goes down to my shorter ones. I think this works really, really well. Hang, it keeps all my necklaces in one place because I think I have kind of a lot of necklaces, including this one I have on right now. And I was never able to find like a really good uh, place to put my necklaces, so I've been struggling with that. But then I found this and I think it works really, really good. So that is what that looks like. And the final things I am going to move on to is clothing, and I only have two shirts to show you guys in this haul today. The first shirt that I got is this Alice in Wonderland one. It is a long sleeve shirt, as you can see. It's kind of like a sweater material, but it's still like a shirt. Oh, I can't see anything. Hopefully you guys are seeing this. Okay, there we go. So as you can see, it has Alice in Wonderland on it with like the Queen of Hearts and um, what's this cat's name? treasure cat treasure cat something like that the cats up there and you have one of the hearts I can't see or one of the hearts one of the like cards and more cards down at the bottom and also like that little animal thing they used to play croquet or whatever that game is <laughs> so that's what the front looks like and also on the back you can just see like trees and stuff like that just like the setting 
that you can see in the movie. I love this shirt. It's super comfortable. This shirt I got at Hot Topic for... It was originally like around $32, $34, but I had some, a gift card, not a gift card, a coupon, so I got some money off of it. And the next shirt that I got is this Cinderella shirt, which I'm so happy because I do not have a Cinderella shirt yet. So it just looks like that, and you can see Cinderella and the prince at the at the ball. Did I say Cinderella? I think I said Cinderella. I don't know. I thought I said it weird. Oh well. Anyway, so there's Cinderella and the prince at the ball. You can kind of see some people in the background. It's a sleeveless shirt and the back is, oh my god, the back is my favorite. You are gonna die. It's see-through, but what I love is just, oh, just everything about it. It's, it's kind of see-through. Let me try to I don't know if you can see it. It's not too bad because it's kind of dark anyways, but yeah, that is what that looks like. I also got this at Hot Topic. It was, I want to say close to $20. So that is what that looks like. And also I did get two other shirts, um, but they are in the process of shipping to my house, so I do not have them right now. And I also have a couple a couple more shirts from Hot Topic and a few things from Bed Bath & Beyond But I am not going to show that in this video because those are actually Christmas presents I got for other people So I don't want to show them in this video because I do not want to ruin the surprise And yes, I know I am a freak that likes to shop for Christmas presents three months before Christmas, so No judging Okay, everyone, that is it for this haul video. If you really like these haul videos, I know I did a couple other ones, make sure to give this a thumbs up so I will know to make more hauls for all of you guys. And also, if you are wondering, all of my links of my Vine, Twitter, Instagram, Tumblr will all be in the description box below, so you can go check those out if you haven't already. Oh, so if there is anything that you guys have bought recently that you are loving, please tell me in the comments, and also you can uh, comment down below with any other video requests or comments, questions, anything like that. I am always here to answer those for you guys and to respond. Alrighty, everyone, that is it for this video. I will see you all in my next video. I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I will talk to you all later. I don't know why I just said y'all. I'm just gonna go because this is just dragging on. Bye, everyone!